Hello, everybody. My name is Istvan Kovac, um, and I'm working for the Elevator Lab uh, team in RBI head office. Today, I'm here in the call with uh, Joanna Genova from Raiffeisenbank Bulgaria, as well as uh, Janusz and Remy from the Polish fintech uh, Synerize. We are currently in the acceleration phase uh, of the Elevator Lab program. That means that we are running a proof of concept together with Synerize and Raiffeisenbank Bulgaria. So uh, I'm, I'm sure you're pretty much aware that this is the first time that Raiffeisen Bank Bulgaria is running a global uh, elevator lab uh, partnership program. So for us, it was a major objective to, to find and scout uh, a very, very high quality fintech solution that would uh, give us the opportunity to develop tools and uh, new ways for Raiffeisen Bank Bulgaria to further expand our advanced analytics and uh, digital capabilities. So basically, this uh, this was our main goal, and actually, Synera is perfectly fit uh, into the picture. So I would be very happy to give them the chance to share more about the, about them. In Synera, uh, we are focused on building the digital identity of business leaders using artificial intelligence. That's the key uh, strategy for us. Our ambition is to become one of the leading tech companies in the world through helping brands better understand customer needs and allowing them to take the communication to the absolutely new levels. We know that competitive advantages are only possible with the deep tech, really, really deep tech, and we know how to translate that to the real business scenarios. AI, I said in the beginning, and thanks to the use of AI and big data, we help companies and organizations to understand better people's needs, preferences, behaviors, drive interactions between them and the brand in the unique, what is called hyper-personalized way. We are building growth operating system. I know that it's a difficult term, um, but we are trying to do this with limitless capabilities and we give our customers so-called ecosystem to create their own apps and the ideas without being limited to the our roadmap so they can play with their uh, vision and use our technology our tools as they wish i'm wondering actually uh, what are things uh, to innovate about it yeah uh, because there are some um, solutions already on the market but it would be very interesting for us to hear how you can innovate in these fields we, we want to break another status quo simply. The, uh, we want to take the, uh, this to the very new level, develop our own technology using experiences and scientific approach. We publish a lot of scientific paper, papers every year in order to over uh, exceed customers' expectations, and customers and our partners. Our goal, immediate goal, is the uh, global expansion, of course, everyone uh, is saying this, and we want to bring our technology and our capabilities to practically every company in the world. And the um, how, you know, innovate uh, we are and what are we doing? We created so-called disruption as a service platform. Thanks to the uh, scale proprietary database, we start with the data, created from scratch. Then we go to the state of art AI algorithms and powerful automation. So we are delivering practical executable scenarios on our platform and make it possible for customers to use it in the real time uh, without technological compromises, without the um, technological debt. So we work and partner with market leaders in top market segments from retail, uh, banking and insurance, automotive, telecommunication and consumer goods. And we support big and small companies in collecting and analyzing data uh, about people, customers, users, and their environment context from multiple data sources uh, to personalize, thanks to our AI engine, uh, their experience, predict future actions, generate, generate new revenue streams, optimize costs, and execute everything at a big scale uh, in real time. Since when does the company exist? When it was founded? And which markets, which geographical markets are you covering, covering so far? So, Sunrise was founded in 2013 uh, and since then we have become the industry leader in our domestic market in Poland, uh, which supports us in our global expansion strategy in sea countries uh, with a focus as well on France, from where uh, I got my obviously French accent. 
Spain, UK, um, as well as in the Middle East region, uh, South America and India. So for the upcoming years, we'll have a lot of work. What would you consider the biggest successes so far in the history of Cinerize? Considering, of course, every little step is a huge achievement in the life of a startup. So being a part of the RBI Elevator Lab is one of it. But if we take the whole history and to identify some of them, Janusz already mentioned one of the company's most important success to date has been the creation of our proprietary database, Terrarium, and that can process, segment, and analyze data uh, at light speed and make it possible to take advantage of short window of opportunity. Uh, additionally to this, Sunrise as a company, we achieved huge successes with uh, our works on pioneering and ambitious projects with clients. A noteworthy example is the digital transformation of one of the biggest convenience chain in Europe, Jabka, whose vision of creating the store of the future is being achieved through uh, through the use of uh, a power, Sunrise powered mobile application. Um, and our team is also proud of reaching a key milestone uh, for the company, which was the successful implementation of our system on premise. Uh, so on the infrastructure infrastructure of one of the most uh, innovative and digitally driven bank in Europe, M-Bank. And to give you some more recent examples, uh, two last one, uh, two of our publications have been awarded in the 2020 Rakuten Challenge, where we face company competition to eBay, Amazon, Apple, so Zalando, even Alibaba. And just after this, we decided to make some of our AI engine papers uh, open source as a way of giving back to the community. I was just wondering, uh, having having such a great uh, background, what is now the next milestone? What's 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 on the agenda? I mentioned earlier the um, our milestone, our the uh, vision is to break the status quo. Now, um, uh, as a synerize. We want to focus not only on the European companies, but we want to go beyond. And the, um, the good example is our presence in Middle East, where we cooperate uh, as a customer with the largest uh, uh, retailer uh, on premise and electronic retail in the, uh, in the region, Sharab DG. Uh, we've started uh, also our projects in US and the other continents. So. Um, Europe, of course, is our home market. This is where we feel the best. Um, we have the uh, the first um, presence in in France, as Remy mentioned. But we need to go outside of the uh, home market, outside of European Union. What do you think? What are the key benefits uh, of having Synerize in the CE region? You know, we were super happy when, uh, uh, first of all, uh, Raiffeisen uh, invited us to the contest and then uh, uh, we went through this very rigorous uh, and difficult uh, challenges uh, during the, uh, the contest and uh, finally uh, got selected. Uh, so we were super proud of this, mm, but this is uh, just the beginning of cooperation, in our opinion, with uh, with uh, Raiffeisen. Uh, we hope that this is a project that will take uh, the advantage of the full use of Synerize's latest developments in the area specifically of machine learning. And we strongly believe this is amazing distinction, which will let us uh, further engage um, with the uh, Raiffeisen around the uh, world, because you're present you know, globally, your global companies. So this transformation with the uh, uh, with our presence will help you to use our uh, innovative solution. Coming back straight to your question, in what way the uh, we might um, contribute to CE region? I think the uh, thanks to synerize the companies from Central and Eastern Europe region will be able to build bridges between their businesses needs and the customer experience. And the uh, and the really advanced technologies. So, Synerize value offering overcomes all major challenges that uh, those companies face uh, in the business to consumer area, and will help them. Perhaps this is our strong uh, opinion to expand further in European markets, in the global markets, because e-commerce is um, a global exchange, global innovation 
has no borders now. Everything, maybe because of the pandemic, changed the paradigm, how we work, how we cooperate, um, how we interact with customers and with the other partners. So we hope that uh, the, this uh, combination of technology and the new way the globe is changed of uh, last 12 months will create really powerful uh, solutions and the uh, wins in the market.